Hello YouTube and welcome to my channel. Uh, I've recently started a video series called Japanese Reading Practice and in this video I would like to explain a little bit why I'm doing that and what I'm doing there exactly. So, um, well with this series I have, this series has two purposes and one is to help myself learning Japanese and the other is hopefully to help others doing the same thing. So, what I'm doing is I'm using this book, Japanese for Everyone. This is not the only book that I use for learning Japanese, but uh, this is the only book that I will be using for these videos. And uh, so if you want to follow me along, you don't have to buy the book, but I'm <clears throat> going to show you what I do with the book. So, this book has 27 lessons and uh, I'm going to spend a whole week on one lesson. But, not on the entire lesson, I'll just focus on the dialogues. And uh, I'll show you how it is set up. Let's just take a random lesson. This is lesson 21. I haven't started on that one yet. And you can see we have a dialogue here. And then there's another dialogue that starts here. And there's a third dialogue over there. And um, most of the lessons have three dialogues. Some have two dialogues. And then after the dialogues, you have a vocabulary list, which starts here on that page and continues up here. Then uh, there are some questions about the dialogue which I ignore and grammatical explanations, I ignore them too. But we also have a translation, here you go, a translation of the dialogues into English. And um, then there are lots and lots of pages with grammar explanations and exercises, uh, reading comprehension exercises, listening comprehension exercises, all kinds of stuff. But I just concentrate on the dialogues, the vocabulary lists and the translation. And uh, I will get to the grammar later on. But right now I just concentrate on the dialogues. And what I do is I spend a whole week and uh, every day I copy all of the two or three dialogues, however much there are in one lesson. And uh, as you can see, I copy them out, write them out by hand. Um, so every day, one week, that's seven times, I copy out those dialogues. And that takes about, well the first time I do it, it might take 45 minutes, because I have to look up a lot of words that I don't know that I don't know and um, try to understand each sentence and every word. And uh, But when I reach the end of the week, it just takes 20 minutes to do that. And I also listen to the audio and while I'm doing that, read along with the text. And I'll do that twice a day. So that'll be 14 times, 14, 15 times. And then I listen without looking at the text for another 50 to 60 times <clears throat> during the uh, entire week. So, once I've done that, I'll do the video. And in the video, I write the text down once more on the whiteboard. And then I first I read it out aloud. And this is the first time that I read it out aloud because uh, uh, I don't do that when I study the text. I just listen and read and write. And um, But since I've listened to it so many times, I still have the voice <clears throat> buzzing in my head. So I I recognize the characters, I know what it means, and I, imme I immediately hear the audio that I've listened to so many times in my head, and I just try to imitate it. Um, and once I've done that, I try to uh, to translate word by word first, and then the entire sentences. So, and then I put it up on YouTube for you to, to watch it, and um, I hope that a lot of people who are either native Japanese speakers or um, uh, are more advanced than I am in Japanese, which is not so hard, um, can comment on my mistakes, which I'm bound to make. I will make mistakes in my pronunciation, in my intonation, uh, maybe in the writing as well, um, and also in the explanation and in the um, translations. 
of course I'm going to make uh, mistakes there because I might not have internalized the grammar or uh, might translate some words in a wrong way and uh, so if, if you would like to comment please do so and uh, that would help me very much and if other people who are beginners of Japanese watch those videos and uh, they can see me explain that text and then look at the comments and see all the corrections that have been made they could profit from that as well so that's uh, the reason why I'm making those videos <clears throat> and uh, I hope you enjoy them I hope you can uh, profit from them or help me and others uh, in, in the process of doing that and uh, one more thing you might have noticed that I'm not using a lot of kanji when I'm writing those texts. That's because in this book they don't use a lot of kanji. So I'm just writing the text as they are written in here, but I leave out the furigana. And um, since I'm, I'm reading it out aloud, so you know what the kanjis are pronounced in that uh, in that in those cases. Um, what else? Uh, well, I think. That's it. And um, as I've said before, I use other resources for learning Japanese. So if you want me to do a resource video or something, just tell me. I, I might do something like that in the future. But right now I'm concentrating on these videos. And um, well, I, I hope I can help other people. And I hope you can help me learning Japanese by commenting. Okay? Thank you very much. Bye-bye.